Likey, subscribe, and comment, mofos. Hey, sexy mama, you're so fine. Who, me? Stop it. Come on, baby. Don't be like that. I just want to take you out for a drink. Did you say drink? <laughs> Eugene, the euphorbia cactus, and Ashanti, the aeonium, got it on. And now she's full of new babies. These are quite young, which we're going to be cutting today. You want to be more precise and careful when taking smaller cuttings, as they have much smaller stems to work with, and they are more fragile, lowering your chances of successful rooting. I also took these two medium-sized cuttings, and I counted about six or seven of the small ones. The rooting process will be exactly the same as explained in detail in the previous video. Put cuttings in rooting hormone. Stick the cuttings in soil in a pot. Ensure the soil stays moist whilst the cuttings are developing their roots, and that's it. You can either use wet soil to start with, or you can hydrate the soil after you've put your cuttings in there. It makes little difference to the rooting process itself. Last time we took four large cuttings off Ashanti, and although three were doing perfectly fine, one was suffering bad, really bad. So I moved him to sick bay, and yes, I just got stung by an opportunia cactus again. Yeah, all right, I might go for this one. That's all right. Good man, of course it is. And I promise you it will get taller and bigger as well. Yeah, fantastic. So, to the lovely gentleman with the bike. So, to the lovely lady with the flower mask. <laughs> so, to the lady with the molecular structure earrings. <laughs> so, to the lady with the Adidas flip flops. Okay. <laughs> Want to know what happened to the one that was in sick bay? Birds flying high, you know how I feel Sun in the sky, you know how I feel Rains drifting on by, you know how I feel It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new life for me And I'm feeling good Oh yeah, baby, you're so fat. Just give me one of them smoochy-woochies. Mm -hmm.